Shifting gears, the Kenya National 15's rugby team, the Simba 15s, is currently focusing on their Sunday fixtures against Tunisia here at home. The team has been uh, training hard at the Barclays Sports Club in Roraka. Katie and Slin Washira with the details of what the team expects to achieve. The clash pitting the Kenya National 15s team against Tunisia this Sunday will be a tale of two teams hunting a crucial win to avoid relegation from the Africa Division 1A Cup. Both teams are on a level playing ground with Kenya having lost to Zimbabwe 2028 while Tunisia lost to Namibia 14-22. Simba 15's captain Innocent Simu says the team is aware of what is at stake. We really want it because uh, we know all is not lost. We want to retain our trophy and uh, we have two games to go and it starts with this one. If we win this one and then uh, whatever happens between Zimbabwe and Namibia and then we go to Namibia and win it, we don't know. Maybe mathematics will happen there and we'll have to retain the cup. So, so far... We're looking at this, this is like our final. 65% of the game is won off the pitch. That is mentally. We've prepared the team well. Kenya's loss to Zimbabwe came after their home win against Portugal. The two sides have met seven times, with Tunisia, who are ranked nine places above Kenya in the world, having a better head-to-head -head record on four wins compared to Simba's three wins. And I believe it's going to be hard. But the advantage we have is the altitude over here. We know we played Tunisia here so many times, and uh, after 20 minutes, they usually finish. So we want to take the same way we played Portugal, like a fast paced game. That's what good tactical sessions that we've been having, plus the strength and conditioning. We have less injuries. And that is why you see the body language, the mental uh, language, the spiritual language. The team is ready for Sunday. The team played against Portugal and away to Zimbabwe without experienced skipper Wilson Kopondo, who has since rejoined the team training, although it remains unclear if he will start on Sunday. Kopondo coming back, remember he started training on Monday. We are assessing his fitness level. We are also assessing his mental level. Is he ready? Then we are also assessing his uh, 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 psychological aspect because... The Simbas will go into Sunday's match ranked 39th, but their top 25 position goal at the end of season remains on course. Lin Washira, KTN.